Anybody has the power to become famous by doing something destructive. Mr. Skrull, do you think you've done anything wrong? I invoke my Fifth Amendment privilege against self-incrimination and respectfully decline to answer your question. Whether we like it or not, Martin Shkreli has made his way into pop culture. Martin Shkreli. Martin Shkreli. Price gouging pharma bro. Doing what he does best, looking like a real slappable prick. I want to figure out how this guy became the most hated man in America. He bought the rights to a life-saving drug, then hiked the price from $13.50 to $750. That's price gouging. Like, yo, that better make you live for a million years. I can't tell his story unless I get to know him. Bring it on. Even his name, Martin Shkreli, sounds like something Stan Lee would have made up. He knew what he was doing was not illegal because we don't have any laws in our country to stop it. Patients with HIV, pregnant women, people with cancer, to take a drug and make it inaccessible to them seems like the height of all evil. $30,000 for one med? I wonder if you would do anything differently. I probably would have raised the price higher. There's just this childlike quality. He likes to show the world that Martin Shkreli has made it. I bought the most expensive album in the history of mankind. Two million dollars for the Wu-Tang Clan CD. How's the album? 100% none of your business. So I decided to move into Martin's apartment building. You Martin Shkreli? Yes. Yes, he is. I've been running into him on the streets. I call into his live stream. Hello. We share the view of Naked Shower Guy. And I still don't know who the real Martin Shkreli is. Do I have your full attention? You don't only get Martin Shkreli. He wouldn't bust a grape in a fruit fight. You get his bizarre character study. Count yeah, suspended. I think it was threatening Lauren Duca. People start to say, is he a sociopath? He wasn't on trial for anything America accused him of. He's just a boogeyman. He's not the real problem. Why do they keep coming after you? It might have something to do with me being very handsome, very well to you. <laughs> By blaming just an individual like Martin Shkreli, we miss the bigger picture. If the law allows someone to do this legally, Martin Shkreli's will show up and do it. What are you going to do about it? <laughs> you want to punch me? Come find me. As you say, it's not going to end well. I have a hard time figuring out if you like Martin or don't like Martin. So do I. <laughs>